Mickey Schroeder, and Deering Golden Boy of the Silver Screen. Enlightened filmgoers of the modern age will always recognize the 1980s as the era of Ricky Schroeder. Bursting onto the scene at the tender age of seven, young Ricky found Hollywood to be the perfect showcase for his incomparable performance abilities, quickly making him the most loved and talented child actor in the history of Hollywood. With a string of back-to-back -back blockbusters including The Last Flight of Noah's Ark, Flight of the Navigator, and most notably an inspired performance as the unforgettable Elliot in E.T. the Extraterrestrial, young Mr. Schroeder found a permanent place deep in the hearts of moviegoers around the globe. Despite concerns of becoming typecast as a young screaming whelp, Ricky Schroeder's successful collaboration with famed film director Steven Spielberg would once again further young Ricky's silver screen stardom as the bespectacled leader of a band of misfits in the timeless adventure classic The Goonies. But as adolescence started to take hold, the maturing Mr. Schroeder decided to pursue more dramatic fare with a starring role as a troubled high school teen in The Breakfast Club. Club, cementing him forever as leader of the Brat Pack and causing every American teen to think of Ricky Schroeder as my kind of guy. Evidently well suited for grittier roles, Schroeder soon found himself front and center in Young Guns, portraying famed Old West vigilante Kiefer Sutherland. And of course, who can forget his moving portrayal as Pony Boy Curtis in the hard-hitting documentary exploring gangland thuggery in The Outsiders, earning Mr. Schroeder legions of fans among old and young alike with a performance that truly captured the spirit of the American teenager. Stay gold, Pony Boy, because that's how your most beloved and loyal fans will always remember Ricky Schroeder. That's Hollywood for you. This is Chase Lansing, your Hollywood VIP reporter, signing out.